From the Owens Outcome Student Media Center, this is Community Connection. Putting you in touch with what's happening within the community and on our campus. Here's your host. Welcome to Community Connection. My name is Rob Thomas. Brandon Gaddy is with TRIO Services here to share information with us about some of the programs and services available to our Owens Community College yes, students. Sir. And uh, an event that's coming up as well. This is something that you've been recognizing for a number of years now. What is that? So First Generation College Student Day is nationally celebrated on November the 8th. Um, it's the day that the Higher Education Act was signed in 1965. And so on First Generation College Student Day, we make a celebration of first generation college students here at Owens. Uh, first Gen is, design, is defined as students, neither parent or guardian has a bachelor's degree from a four year institution. Um, and so those are the students on our campus, adult, young, uh, however you look at it, if you're a student at Owens and you're a first gen student, that's the day we come together to celebrate the programs and also just to make becoming first generation a badge of honor. It's a, it's a label that many times we don't often tell people about. And so to be a first gen college student, you really are a trailblazer and we want to celebrate that. There are a lot of stories that could be told as well. The struggles that people have because getting a college degree an education, that is not an easy task, especially as you get older, you have other responsibilities address that. Right. Uh, a lot of times it's just the fact that we don't know how to navigate higher education, right? Many times this is not the same thing as going to high school. Uh, it's not structured for you to go every day. It's not structured for you to have to be in a classroom a certain time every day. Um, many times you're also learning how to pay for this on your own trying to figure out between work and school and home and family, trying to figure out how to make the bills do, right? Uh, other things you find out is college is solely different than high school in the sense of the workload. You're looking at, uh, when you speak about a lot of different majors, it's not just about what you can remember, it's about what you can apply, right? And so you're trying to navigate all of this without knowing where to go, who to talk to, uh, or what resources are available to you. And many times you just get lost. Right? Or you get to a place where you don't know what to do or who to talk to. And sometimes it's just like, I throw my hands up. And we don't want students to do that. We want you to realize that there is a community of people who are willing to support you, um, not just because they're administrators, but because we work and advocate for first generation college students. Advocation and uh, resources. What's the relationship between first gen students and TRIO services? So TRIO programs are a group of programs through the Department of Education. Uh, we have two programs here at Owens now. One is Educational Opportunity Center, uh, which works with adult learners who are trying to get into college or thinking about college, as well as helping them navigate some of the things like completing a FAFSA, filling out a college application. Then we have Student Support Services, SSS, which works with students who are on campus already. Uh, they're enrolled in classes, they're taking classes already, but they need some additional supports, academic supports, coaching. Uh, sometimes it's just a community of folks to say, hey, this is what I'm a part of, as well as a part of the institution, right? So TRIO programs work with individuals who are first generation, meaning neither parent has a bachelor's degree, low or limited income, typically means a student is Pell Grant eligible, or who have a physical, mental, or learning disability that's documented. Um, and so Student Support Services provides those coaching and academic initiatives where educational opportunity centers help students as they're getting into the process and deciding on what majors, what programs they want to do in the beginning or do long term. Uh, I think long term, when you think about TRIO programs, you're talking about a group of programs that are really here to help students embrace that identity and also learn how to speak for themselves, right? To put their voice out there to make sure individuals know and they're not shy or timid about what they need as a student. Brandon Gaddy has been our guest and thank you so much for coming in. We're going to hear more about First Gen as it gets closer. Yes, sir. It's in November. Stay tuned so you'll hear more about it here on Community Connection. For Brandon Gaddy, I'm Rob Thomas. This has been Community Connection. If your group or organization would like to appear on Community Connection, message us from the Owens Community College Radio Facebook page. From the Owens Outcome Student Media Center, this has been Community Connection.